You don't know about gay marriage, Mike Todd? I know it's not popular in this culture. I know you'll lose the thousands of people in your church, Mike Todd. I know it. And preach what the Bible says. I, I, something came across my Twitter feed from Chris Williams, uh, who has a Twitter feed where he, and has a podcast, he's a YouTuber, that uh, challenges ministers and you know, calling out when they move away from doctrine. And it came across my Twitter feed, Chris's tweet about Mike Todd on trans homosexuality. Quote, I wish God would have made this simpler, but I don't know, we stand with them trans people. It's in our title, Transformation Church, uh, no joke. And that was a quote that Chris was saying that Mike Todd used during his sermon. And I saw the tweet, watched the clip, got upset, said I was embarrassed, and was like, this is a total pivot from the Mike Todd that I originally discovered in 2020. Let's play Chris's video that he used with his tweet that got me to respond. I know, honestly, I wish God would have made it so much simpler that it was like A, B, C, or D, like frick. <laughs> no, I'm serious. As a pastor, like, so what do you think about gay marriage? I don't know. You don't know about gay marriage, Mike Todd? I know it's not popular in this culture. I know you'll lose the thousands of people in your church, Mike Todd. I know it. And preach what the Bible says. How about this, Mike Todd? Give us Jesus' view of, of, of marriage. Give us Jesus' view of marriage in Matthew 19, where he says it's between male and a female. Maybe you should read more of the Bible and preach more of the Bible than all these props. You know what I'm saying? Maybe you would know then. And you're welcome at Transformation Church. Trans is in the title. Transformation, you can be here. What? Transformation? I thought that had to do with them being having a transformed life, not... A shout out to trans people. It, it, he's just capitulated to the culture right there. I'm still a bit of a journalist. And so Chris did provide a link to the full sermon. And I, you know, I know how to get Mike Todd's full sermons. And so uh, a, a couple of days ago, I went and watched the full sermon and I pulled down my tweet put up another tweet saying, hey, I apologize for uh, originally endorsing this. I went and watched the full sermon, and this is a complete distortion of what Mike Todd actually had to say. And so I, I, I can't, Mike speaks for a long time. He does two hour sermons. This one's only 93 minutes. Can't play the whole 93 minutes. We'll play some of it throughout the day, but I, I wanna give you a, about a five minute, collage of things that Mike said on this particular issue that Chris called him out for, and then we're gonna bring Chris on to help me understand and explain to the audience why he, in my view, distorted what Mike said. But here, I think, is a collage. It's about a nine, 10 minute portion of Mike's sermon that we've reduced down to four or five minutes that I think is a proper reflection of what he was trying to say. Culture teaches you to value your opinion. Kingdom teaches you to submit your opinion. Submission means that it has to become sub to the what? Mission. God's saying, take your opinion about whatever it is and put it under what I said about it. Think whatever you want to think, but just take that and put it under here. And when you act or you're an ambassador or a representative of me, when you're serving me, do not let your opinion come out of your mouth. How do you know you're serving the king? It's usually the opposite of what you naturally want to do. I'm trying to give you, I serve the king. No, you do what you want to do. You, you value your opinion of it more than you value God's, <laughs> not just opinion, his decision on it. God's already decided some stuff that we think we have, can have an opinion on. 
God decided male and female. I, no, 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 I'm not, this is not a bad, I need y'all to hear my heart on this. This is not a bashing, this is not a, he, if I was there, maybe I would have told him, is there something in the middle you could do? Like kind of a, like a little maybe if somebody, well, I was born like this, I don't know how I feel. That I, I feel you. And I wish that there was an option of other in the kingdom. In culture, you can make up whatever you want to. In culture, you can build whatever you want to, but it's the truth of the matter is that if we are going to submit under what the king says, I'm going to have to wrestle with what I don't even fully understand. Oh God, the pastors don't say this because they want to be absolute. Well, why did that? I don't freaking know. I, no, honestly, I wish God would have made it so much simpler and it was like A, B, C, or D, like frick. No, I'm serious. As a pastor, like, so what do you think about gay men? I don't know. But I do know in the kingdom. They're going to cancel me. In the I'm not the king. I don't, I don't know why he decided to do it like this. I don't know why you're wrestling like that. And I don't know what to do to help you, but to stand with you and pray with you and not, and you're welcome at Transformation Church. Trans is in the title. Transformation, you can be here. Oh God. You want your love here? I want you here. Will I marry you? I, I can't, not because I don't think you found love. Just as a kingdom ambassador, when I look back at the orders that are in the constitution of the kingdom, I know people don't talk like this because they want it to be black and white, but there's some things on this earth I don't have the answers to. And so when I don't know, I just default. I come sub to the mission. I know people are going to try to make this clickbait and make it something I didn't say. I hope you hear the heart of what I'm saying. Chris Williams, uh, welcome to the show. Mike says in there that people are going to make this clickbait and take him out of, out of distort what he's saying. I, I, I feel like you did that. Why, why do you feel like you did not distort what he said? Well, first and foremost, Jason, huge fan of the show. Thank you for having me. Uh, well, I don't feel like I took him out of context because I ultimately believe he pandered to both sides. In that clip, you'll actually see him saying things that are true, absolutely, but, but also him saying things that I believe any minister who's convinced that trans is sin would not say saying things like he wished God made it more simpler um, was well, is very simple male female you know he states that this issue is not black and white it is black and white male female that's it and so ultimately he answers the question I believe and, and I'm hopefully I'm just I, I, I'm trying to be fair and gracious as well he answers the question I believe like a politician when they're asked about abortion they say things like Hey, do you believe abortion is wrong? Well, I am pro-life, but I'm also for a woman's choice. Well, that's not an actual answer to the question, and you're actually answering contradictory. If if a pro-choice politician told me that, hey, I'm for women having the right to an abortion, but because I'm a believer. I'm going to vote and use my political power to make sure abortion is not an option for her because you know what? Despite what I believe, God has made a ruling on murder, and so I'm going to bend to what God wants. 
and I say this and people think I'm cracking a joke, but I'm being dead serious. I want a Big Mac right now. God doesn't want me to have it, so I'm going to have to submit and not have it. You know, you can think and feel a bunch of things, and I think Mike has the right to feel empathy for people that are clearly mentally ill and confused while, while saying, but you know what? I'm not mentally ill or confused. I'm going to lean into this Bible and, and on things that I don't understand, I'm just going to go default to the Bible. I don't have a problem with a minister standing on that. Like what you saw? Hit that like button, subscribe, and check out the full episode by clicking the link below. Thank you.